in her mid 40s and she came to see us because she was concerned about fine lines around the eyes and also an oily acne prone skin. I decided to go and see Dr Natalie because I'd noticed my skin deteriorating over the few years, beginning with the crow's feet around my eyes, but in particular my, my general skin was getting quite spotty, um, sort of around my cheeks, my forehead, um, and that seemed to be mainly post-children, uh, it was getting a lot worse. Because the lines around Cathy's eyes are quite fine, she'd be an ideal candidate for a small amount of Botox. When we do a Botox treatment, we err on the side of caution. We tend to put in a small amount initially. Botox will take between three and five days to have any effect at all. And you'll see the full result at two weeks. At two weeks, and I would bring our patients back into the clinic to review the result and decide whether or not we need to put any more Botox into the area. Dr. Natalie prescribed two different treatments, Botox for my crow's feet and products from the ZO skincare range for my acne. Cathy's essentially got combination skin and we call it the oily T-zone. So she tends to get more acne breakouts along the forehead, nose area and down onto the chin. We've suggested a number of products from the ZO Skin Health range. We'll get Cathy back in again and reassess her skin needs and in likelihood probably add more products in as are required. It took three to four days for the ZO products to start working. The initial thing was the reduction of spots, which was quite immediate. And then after a couple of weeks, uh, I could really tell my skin was a lot softer and smoother in its appearance. Um, and after a, another couple of weeks, the, the marking from the previous spots was beginning to reduce as well. 